Alright YouTube, what has got Scyther 5000 here today bringing you a Fart and Seek quest guide. The quest requirements for this quest are I must have at level 25 Slayer and I also must have completed Rag and Bone Man. The items you'll require for this quest are 9 bags of salt, 8 normal logs, a mirror shield along with armour and a weapon. Finally, once you're ready, make your way to Odd Old Man's house which is to the west of Canifis or to the north east of Varrock. So once you arrive at the quest start location, go ahead and speak with Odd Old Man. Select option number one, yes, and that'll be the quest now started. So from here you want to make your way out to the Fremenic province, and then you want to make your way to the Lodestone. Either teleport out to the Lodestone, or you're going to have to teleport to Sears Village and then run all the way up to the Lodestone. So once you get off the lodestone, you should see black unicorns walking around. You want to go ahead and kill one of them that's level 33. And then once you've done that, you should get a black unicorn hide. Go ahead and pick that up. From here, you now want to head to your southeast. And then eventually you will reach the entrance to the Fremenic Slayer dungeon. You want to go ahead and enter this. Go ahead and kill a cave crawler, which should be the first monsters you come across inside the cave. Once they're dead, you should get cave crawler skin. Go ahead and pick that up. You then want to head further into the cave. And then eventually when you follow the path round north to a bit, you should come across these cockatrice. Go ahead and kill one of these. Once that dies, it will drop cockatrice skin. Go ahead and pick that up. You then want to exit out of the cave. From where we're standing, you want to head down to your southwest. And then you want to go west when you reach the divination portal. In this forest you should see adult white unicorns, these are level 15, go ahead and kill one of these, and then this time you should get a unicorn hide, go ahead and pick that up. From here you want to continue in a westerly direction, we're now looking out for foxes and grizzly bears. Once you've found and killed the fox, go ahead and pick up the fox's pelt. You then want to continue west and eventually you should find a grizzly bear. Go ahead and kill a grizzly bear adult. These are level 32s. Killing a cub will be no benefit to you at all. Once you kill the grizzly bear, it's going to drop fur and it's also going to drop pelt. Go ahead and pick up the pelt. I picked up the fur by accident. Do not do the same mistake I did. Pick up the pelt. You're then going to head up to your northwest. And then you should eventually come across Fenris Wolves. Go ahead and just kill one of these. You then want to go and pick up its pelt. From here you want to head back up to your northeast and we're going to enter into Relica. You want to head then to the very north of Relica. Up here you'll then find rock crabs, go ahead and kill a rock crab and then you should get a rock crab carcass, go ahead and pick that up. And then finally you should also find some hobgoblins up here, go ahead and kill one of them. And then pick up the hobgoblin skin. Once that's done you should have a black unicorn hide, a unicorn hide, a bear pelt, a fox pelt, a furnace wolf pelt, hobgoblin skin, rock crab carcass, cave crawler skin and cockatrice skin in your inventory. Once you have all of them you want to make your way back to the odd old man. 
So once you've arrived back at the odd old man's house, go ahead and use the bags of salt on that hides, fur and carcasses. Once you're done that, you should have used up all your salt. You then want to head just up to your north and there is a fire pit which you can add logs to. You then want to go ahead and add logs to the fire, however, do not light them up yet. You then want to use the hides and pelts on the massive ribs just beside you. When you light up the logs, these will basically last for 12 seconds and during them 12 seconds, it will then tan the hides or pelts that are on the massive ribs. You need to simply just do this for all of the eight hides and pelts. The carcass does not get tanned. This might take you a wee bit of time, can take up to five minutes to do, but it's basically a very simple process of just literally adding a log to the fire, adding the hide or pelt onto the massive rib, but waiting for it to tan after the fire goes out and then collecting it. Once you're finished tanning all the hides and pelts, go ahead and speak with the odd old man again. And then that'll be the quest complete. So congratulations, you've completed Fur and Seek. You're awarded with two quest points, 2,500 Constitution XP, 2,500 Slayer XP, 1,500 Prayer XP, 500 Crafting XP, and 500 Firemaking XP, along with two Treasure Hunter keys. Thanks very much for checking out this quest guide. Please leave it a like, rating, and subscribe if you are new around here. Go down into the description below, check out all my playlists for my different quest series, and I'm sure I will be able to help you out with another quest down there as well. And that is all for this video, so thank you very much for watching, and I'm out. Adios.